what most actors do, and we're all guilty of it, is we somehow shift the conversation to talking about ourselves and all of our booked gigs. And it's normal to do that. We are validating that we are actors. Instead, I want you to be an actor that asks questions. And I'm going to give you three questions that you can put in your back pocket and keep with you and ask regardless of who you're interacting with on set. I'm Spurgeon Perkins and I'm an actor just like you. I have booked with major brands such as Audi, Hoover, Pepsi, and Fortnite Nintendo Switch. I got to work with an actor, an actor, an actor recently that I've admired from afar for some time now. And we were on set all day together. And he was fantastic at just asking people questions. He has a very established resume with TV shows that I know you watch that are very popular shows. And still, he was great at being interested and not just trying to be interesting, and he books. Sometimes it just so happens that you do end up interacting with a director more than just working. I was on set and we had a lunch break and the director came and sat at my table. You definitely want to have smart questions to ask. First question, are you from here? You're going to get some backstory about how they ended up there or if they are from there. So that leads you into your second question. So what got you interested in fill in the blank? Acting, directing, producing, just depending on who you're talking to. Again, you're going to get some backstory and some insight into that person's goals and their dreams and aspirations. So then you can follow up with a third question. Okay, so then what is like your ultimate dream job? Like what job would you really love to have? Or you have, are you already doing it? That is really going to help you in your future interactions with them if you can follow up on those answers. So maybe they're really doing a lot of commercials right now, but they want to get into the indie circuit. So then next time you see them, hey, like, have you have you been able to work on any indie flicks? If you're an actor that's really that interested in other people, it is going to go well for you. We are inundated with self-promotion nowadays. So that means you need to remember what it was that you guys talked about. If that means you have to take notes or start a spreadsheet for your booked gigs, which you should have anyway, and in the notes section, put who you chatted with and what you guys chatted about. If you know any other actors that need this information, please feel free to share or tag anyone if you think that that would be appropriate. You know them better than I do. And next week, we're going to talk about the casting office. I have some really good tips for you that I've gotten good feedback on and a story that is going to make you cringe a little bit.